Hello everyone, uh, welcome back for this uh, video, uh, it's number 12. Uh, we are going to discuss about the object property characters uh, in all. Uh, in this uh, video, we don't have the exercise, uh, but uh, this uh, in the, uh, the case study is a very important uh, the chapter. Uh, so I would like that you can read through uh, the documents and get the full understanding of those uh, characteristics uh, in the object property. Uh, in the left, you can see uh, the characterist is listed in the middle. If you select our object property, it has a total of seven. So I put in the, uh, this uh, picture here. Uh, and if you uh, come to uh, the document is on the uh, chapter 4.8. Uh, it's list about five uh, because uh, first three uh, are the separate uh, the carry, uh, properties, uh, and the last four are paired. So symmetric is paired as the asymmetric as the vice versa. Uh, similarly, it's reflexive and the irreflexive is vice versa. Uh, so, uh, for you to have uh, some more uh, the easier uh, to understand this uh, in uh, this uh, repository in GitHub, uh, I'm updating this uh, Mind Manager uh, 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 the file. Uh, so this file, uh, which I can show you, uh, what I uh, have done is using uh, the uh, this file, uh, the documents or tool, so free plan. So you can also get this uh, free plan uh, tool to uh, have uh, some understanding and open this uh, file uh, to uh, serve you uh, easier reading. So uh, you can read uh, the PDF, uh, but here I digest uh, the key uh, information for these uh, five sub uh, chapter. Uh, for you. Uh, so every property or property uh, pair, uh, I extract the definition uh, and our sample. For example, functional property uh, is a sample is as has a birth mother. Uh, has birth mother also are symmetric the property. And if you read on this uh, 481, it's also mentioned is uh, they have the relationship uh, with this uh, cardinality uh, restriction uh, chapter on 4.16. So uh, I connect them. Uh, and you uh, you will also uh, need to uh, get more understanding on the differentiation uh, between or among those uh, uh, the properties. Uh, the last uh, subchapter also uh, gave you some uh, ideas uh, within the Protege. Actually, it help uh, you to do some automating uh, the properties uh, identification through the reasoner. So that can save a lot of your time. Uh, also, uh, if you click on this uh, link, uh, you, you can see here. So uh, I also uh, gave you uh, this uh, reference link. Uh, this is a very important uh, the specification. Uh, so you can read uh, actually the real definition for those uh, properties, uh, especially on the uh, chapter four. So all these uh, properties are here. Uh, so I hope is, uh, you can uh, get some more understanding and you can through, uh, you can uh, create our, uh, the separate, uh, the old file using the property and try to uh, create uh, some uh, the uh, the individuals with the object uh, property, then try uh, this uh, characteristic. Uh, so I, uh, that's all for uh, this uh, video. I hope is you can uh, get to and open this uh, mind file to uh, mind map file to get some uh, idea on this. Uh, and uh, after that is uh, I will move to 4.9 and we will see the property domain and the range, uh, the practice. Uh, thank you for watching. Bye.